Hi, this is Josh, pharmacist with Learn Blood Sugar Testing. We're going to take a look at how to set up and use the Mateen Blood Glucose Monitoring System, the TD4116 Glucose Monitor. Um, I do have separate videos on showing how to use the Lancet device as well as the control solution. You can check those out if you need to. Um, but we're going to take a look at setting up the meter. First thing you'll want to do is insert the battery. The battery is accessed on the back there. Remove that. It does take a triple A battery, so you can go ahead and insert the battery. You want to leave the battery uh, compartment open so you can access the set button. You press the set button until it beeps, and then the first option is the year. The year is correct, so I'm going to press the set button to go on. If you want to adjust the year, you can press the M button to adjust the year. We'll press the set button again. Now we're to the month. The month is not where you want it. You keep pressing the M button till it is to your desired setting. Press the set button. Then we're on to the date again, same process. Press the M button till it's the correct date. Press the set button. Now we're on if you want 12 hour or 24 hour time, AM and PM or what some people call military time. Put it to your de desired setting. Press the set button. Now we're on to the hour. Again, the M button to adjust the hour. The, M, the set button to go on to the minutes. And once minutes are where you want it, pretty simple. Again, press the set button. And then this option is to delete the memory, delete the meter memory. You, If you have it set to yes and press the set button, it will delete all your readings. If you leave it set to no, it will keep your readings in memory. And press that set button again. Now it's ready. This um, It does have some optional alarms as well. This is in the off setting. I'm just gonna leave it to that. I believe there's three different alarms. So you can switch that to on or off and set those should you desire. There's alarm three. And then you press set again. Oh, and there's a four alarms. And once you go through the four alarms, it is now ready to be used. So we can go ahead and put the battery door on. And then to prepare, prepare your hands, you need to wash in warm soapy water, thoroughly dry them, and then clean the area with a alcohol swab. Ensure that that dries properly. And you'll get your test strip ready. Make sure you always reseal your test strip bottle after you remove a test strip. And then you put that in the top of the meter here. Just like that. And then it will prompt you that it is ready to check. There's a flashing drop of blood there to let us know that. So we have our Lancet device all ready here. I prefer the side of a finger. So it's, I've already cleaned and prepared the area. And we'll go ahead and get that. And they recommend that you wipe, use a clean tissue to wipe away the initial drop of blood to prevent any contaminants that may affect that reading. And then once you have that second drop of blood, you go ahead and touch the test strip to it. And there's your reading, 99. I just ate an hour ago, so that's pretty good. Um, and that's that's all there is to it. That's the Mateen TD4116 blood glucose monitor. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. I'll do my best to answer it for you. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you appreciate this content like this, please like the video and subscribe to my channel.